Hello! Uh, welcome to my stream of the Great Ace Attorney Chronicles. Um, I haven't streamed in a long time because I've been busy <laughs> with a lot of stuff. But I really want to get back to, into it and I'm super hyped for this game. Um, yeah, I've just been a fan of like the other Ace Attorney games so this is super exciting that they like localized this uh, for English speaking audiences. So yeah, let's uh, let's go. I did try to stream this um, yes, last night, but my internet was being really weird, so I'm just hoping it goes much smoother this time. Um, yeah, okay, okay, so there's the first one and the second one, which is great, that's awesome. Uh, yeah, let's go, new game. The Empire of Japan. After opening its doors, a push for cultural transformation brought great waves of Western influence to this far eastern island nation. The I did see this bit land, already, making life in the but I'm not going to be like surprised during this opening. It was a period of great change, and some were swept away by the tide. But for one man, the turbulence of that era was just the beginning of an extraordinary story. <sighs> and this is our protagonist. And just like Phoenix, just like Phoenix, he's been like, um, he's been framed for a crime. So, like, I wonder if he's, if he's, uh, related to Phoenix, right? If he's like an ancestor or something. I know there was a team of translators who translated like the first couple cases of this game for the 3DS. And I did try to get it on my 3DS, but it never worked. So I'm just, I'm so hyped that it's out in English. Ryunosuke. I hope I'm saying that right. Ryunosuke. Naruhodo. Second year student at the Imperial Yume University. Like, I wonder if he's also gonna turn into a lawyer. Or if he's like... In in law or whatever, uh, he's not he's not obliged to listen to such abuse officer. Like this anime headband is so so good, so stylish. I'm a huge fan of that. And the way it's just like waving randomly indoors, that's great, great, uh, great character decision. Why do you- why does he have a sword? I just noticed that. He has a sword. Like, he's already so cool. Such a good entrance. Kazuma. Kazuma. <laughs> How dare you apologize?
Okay, but in the opening scene, it looked like there was a bunch of witnesses. So I wonder about that. Kazuma Asogi, my best friend, also in his second year at Yuma University. Like, how old are these- how old are these people? Like, look at this, this window isn't even open. <laughs> yeah, this is just wavy. <laughs> and even in this illustration, it looks like it's wavy. him already. He's so supportive. Oh my god. And this line, this line makes so much sense now. It's like there's some mysterious aura billowing around his temple. So that, that might explain why this is just like waving in the air like that. The heart of the British Empire. No, wait, is this the place where he supposedly kills the professor? English class tomorrow, partner. Wait, okay, hold on. I, I missed the line. Um, it was straight after that. That's when it happened. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so it was in that restaurant. The heck? Like, nobody saw the real killer? There's like no conflict of interest at all. No introduction. No introduction at all. So his name is just gonna be a question mark? <laughs> yes, and you are? Eugene Mikotoba. I'm a professor of forensic medicine at Yuma University. A 
I love that best friends is highlighted in orange. That must be important. to Great Britain. Ooh. Ooh, the pressure. The pressure is on. <laughs> so why so why didn't you tell me? Yeah, his dreams will be shattered and his best friend will go to jail. That's so much pressure on this one trial, what the heck? Like, why- okay, why is this guy even here, though? He didn't explain that yet. Pecu peculiarities about today's trial. What? What does that mean? The judge will pose a certain question to the defense. When that happens, you must answer before anyone else. You must say, I do. What? Is this like a quick time of it? I do? Oh. Do you accept the accusations brought before you? <laughs> Let's go, first case. I don't even know what that word means. Must not be the defense lawyer in this trial. Well, who's gonna defend me then? <laughs> I feel like- I feel like that would be worse, dude. I feel like that would be worse, being guilty of murder. <laughs> Let's do it! Oh my god! <laughs> he looks so scared! Yeah, no kidding, they look so serious. It's just the same guy over and over again. Ooh, a secret trial. What the f- okay, that's wild though, why? It was just a- it was just a professor. 
Was he a spy? Maybe the professor is more important than we thought? Maybe? <laughs> it's that prosecutor from like all the other Phoenix Wright, Wright games. Oh, ouchie. <laughs> Ouchie. Man, I can't remember that prosecutor's name in the other games though. I, I want to say Sakamoto, but I feel like that's wrong. <laughs> This judge looks way more serious than the other judge. What but- What? Okay, but then I have to answer to who's going to defend me with I do? I'm confused. I'm confused. He said to answer as fast as possible, right? Yes. Yo. I do! Oh! Oh! Okay. That's wild. Is he even a- is he even a law student though? He's so caring! Oh, they care about each other so much! Like, this guy has an air of victory about him. There's, like, no way he would lose. And clearly, his eyes <laughs> are his eyes just gonna be like darting back and forth the whole game. Oh, <laughs> oh classic, classic Phoenix expression. What? You're gonna test me?
Oh, I don't know if I'm competent. Kindly state before the court the name of the victim in this case. Well, I don't know his name! It's just the professor. of E, okay. Well, this is the list of evidence you've collected. Now try switching to people instead with E. Oh, okay, cool. What? This dude's only 23 and he's a lawyer? Okay, got it. Got it. Um, E. Eugene Mikotoba. Okay. Uh, John H. Wilson. <laughs> John H. Wilson is the victim of this case. He was a visiting professor of medicine at Yuma University from the British Empire. John H. Wilson. Okay, John. Okay, John H. Wilson. Sorry for killing you. And press R to present. Yes! <laughs> Such a, like, softball question. That's why it's like a secret trial. Okay. Got it. Yeah, no wonder, no wonder it's a big deal. I was really wondering if this game was ever gonna come over to uh, English audiences because I think it has like a lot- I think it has some themes of uh, being critical of the Japanese government, but that's just from like the snippets that I've like read. Um, so yeah, I'm just glad it's here. Uh, but all because the victim was an Englishman. John Wilson. Yeah, and you were holding a gun! Like, how did he even get a gun in his hand? Man, please don't tell me Kazuma, like, 
ends up being a bad guy or like a traitor or something, I will be so devastated. him and killed him Postmortem report. Uh, death occurred a little after 2 p.m. and was caused by loss of blood from a gunshot to the chest. The bullet did not pass through the victim's body. It's caused by blood loss. Oh, so the bullet is still in the in the body? A little after 2 p.m. Okay. Okay. Yes! According to this document, the victim suffered a hemorrhagic death due to gunshot trauma. <laughs> Ouch, that's so harsh. So that means that So that means that there's going to be no um no surprise autopsy reports like what Edgeworth does Wait, there's photographs? What the heck? Hey, he was shot at close range, but the bullet didn't leave his body. Hmm. Like, rest in peace, uh, John Wilson, but why wouldn't they just shoot him in the head? Wait, is that his first time seeing a photograph? Oh yeah, it must be. Like, I have so many questions already. <laughs> oh, so many questions. Like, how did- how did he end up with a gun in his hand? And how did nobody see how, uh, John Wilson died? Oh, 
<laughs> a loophole. That's what you that's what you need in a courtroom though. You need that you need that assertiveness. He's obviously a waiter. Uh Satoru Hosonaga. Sonaga. <laughs> La Carnival. Um, excuse me? What? Why are you bleeding? That's- that's, uh, tuberculosis. <laughs> what was that? What the fuck? Bro, get that checked out! But you guys hired a waiter who's clearly has some uh, internal bleeding somewhere. Lawyer boy. Crockery. <laughs> Crockery is like pots and pans, I guess. Found it on the floor. Objection! Just chill. blood off your face. It's so weird. This man is sick. There was someone else. Ooh, Jane Wilson.
Oh, you gotta wait. You gotta wait and see. You gotta chill. I've been worried about interjecting, but still, you gotta wait and see. You're gonna get penalized, bro. Let's chill. We'll wait. You're the one who told me to chill! Dang! Yes! Attention! <laughs> Shut up! He's gonna get mad at me for interjecting. <laughs> what? Yo, that's sketchy. I don't think his glasses are working. And I don't think this man is fit to stand trial. I'm really worried for him. I actually have a rough plan of the restaurant as it was that day. Oh, what? When did you draw this? Okay, but that's not a photograph. That's not surveillance footage. is gonna die on the stand. Man, you know what? This pandemic is like making me like so weary of people just like coughing into their hands. It's like grossing me out more than usual. What? Yeah, that's not happening. What? Okay, wait, I'm gonna- wait. What's the difference between a sworn witness and an unsworn witness? The fuck do you think?
He's scared, bro. Kazuma's got you. Man, he's so cool. Man, he's so cool. The young can be so reckless. The young and the reckless. <laughs> That's, why does that sound gross? You know, many call me a saint, but I can be a devil when I want to be. We're not gonna we're not gonna find out what uh illness the waiter had. No sa Yes uh, no sa. Kore kuta kore kuta I don't trust him. He only has like one eye lens. so strange oh he reminds me of the guy from spider-man <laughs> what's his i don't remember his name the guy who like tells spider-man tells peter parker to get pictures of spider-man it's like <laughs> jo jo like jameson something like that it starts with a j i think that's who he reminds me of Probably the lady who killed him. Like, we still don't know who she is. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering about that noise. Can we, can we, like, replay that noise? I guess not. There's, like, a weird noise in here somewhere. Excuse me, is there like a baby in the courtroom?
Because this thing here is really strange. Like, I don't know if that's part of the uniform at the time. But I feel like he has, like, an infant child just, like, on his back. <laughs> but I don't know. <laughs> Maybe that's just part of the uniform and I'm, like, uncultured and I don't know that. Who the- who talks like that? I was ingesting a regulation beef steak at the restaurant while having a tactical discussion with the old man. Nobody talks like that. <sighs> yeah, okay. <laughs> I have no idea what these people are saying. What the fuck is that sound? That's a baby. That's a baby noise. Black uniform varsity cadet fired on the English civilian. And from the back? And from the back, the cowardly little weasel. What? He couldn't have been shot from the back. I was on my hands and knees investigating the whereabouts of my mysteriously absconded precious curio. Okay, well then this guy didn't see shit. I think it's the um I think the contradiction is in the getting shot from the back. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear that, but there's like a weird baby noise every time the soldier finishes a sentence. Like, why would you pick up the gun? Okay, wait, okay, so he wasn't- he wasn't shot by this gun. He must have been shot by a different gun. Because he wasn't shot yet. Music's getting hyped up. Yes. <laughs> the look on his face is so good. The Hachimaki headband boy next door told me to do it. What's that? What's Hachimaki mean? Hachimaki? Objection! <laughs> so commanding, scary. I think he's a defense lawyer, not a prosecutor. Oh, 
Okay, here we go. Hachimaki. A hachimaki is a Japanese headband, usually made of red or white cloth, typically featuring a design of kanji at the front. Uh, they are worn as a symbol of effort or courage by the wearer, especially by those in the military, or to simply keep sweat off of one's face. Okay, got it. <laughs> I don't know why I never knew that. Sound was so pathetic. It was just a little slap. Ooh, I get five lives? That's very, very generous. But do I have the evidence that I can present? Oh, the photograph. Okay, got it. <laughs> got it. Got it. where we reload the save and continue on. <laughs> that won't happen. That won't happen here. Man, Kazuma needs to be in like a fighting game. Um... Oh, we can press. Okay. <laughs> Firearm is discharged. I, I observe the enemy's actions with my own eyes. Can I press? Yes! yes. Oh, that slap so much. Got him. Got him.
Maybe the baby sound again. Okay, yeah, this is the part where I would present. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna press first. Yes. Oh, and I want to see what he has to say. playing on my mind for some mean okay <laughs> so intense thrust it in the witness's face and make him choke on it <laughs> let's do it How can I go back oh yeah oh no I can't present this photograph where he was clearly shot from the front. Wait, magnifying glass? Yes! The music stopped. <laughs> the music stopped. That's how you know that's that's the one. That little animation where he like looks back at his hand is a very very nice touch. Man, and this guy didn't even eat his steak before he died. We learn to have as much impact as uh, Kazuma has on the courtroom.
Yeah, like that's not possible. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, there is a baby. Okay. <laughs> there is a baby. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Okay, okay, so that isn't part of the Japanese military uniform. Why is he just like carrying his baby? Or a baby? Whose baby is that? Is a fucking liar. Oof, oof, ouchies. Even I felt that. Oh, name drop. Ace Attorney. Oh my god, my guy. Yes! Obviously, that's not possible. Like, why is he even here? The Hoi Era Koban, my prized coin. Dropped it? He lost it? Is it, what? Is this important? Maybe it's in the photo. Hmm, maybe I'll, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna put a magnifying glass in the photo. Just for fun. Magnifying glass. I mean I don't even know what this coin looks like. But it might be here. Or not. Or not. Okay, never mind. <laughs> that was nothing.
就是，哈哈。But they've already proved that they're untrustworthy. Why do they still get to be on the stand? Like everybody just forgot that there was a lady sitting beside John, uh, sitting beside John Wilson. That's cool. <laughs> I don't. This this baby's gonna come into play. Forgetting that there was like a woman beside him. How did nobody see her? Yes. Your fantasies. Ooh, another photograph. Okay, indeed, of the table at which the victim was dining, taken by an investigator immediately after the incident. I could have just like ran into him there. That's so weird. It's like she's a ghost. No, no, no. We still gotta cross examine.
There is something going on behind the scenes. Ow, how though? Um, I think I'm just gonna press every every statement <laughs> just to get to like the full story here. Um, even if what I saw wasn't the precise moment, the firearm was discharged. It's almost the same thing. Yes, yes. Didn't explain doesn't explain anything. Okay, he was on the ground looking for a coin. I don't think he saw anything. Yes, pointing his gun at the foreign man he was. Uh, that young lad in black. That much I myself could see. Fresh. Yes! Like, that's so sketchy. I, I don't know why he picked up that gun at all. <laughs> that was a bad move. Bad move on his part. Just a bad move, my guy. Just a bad move, Ryunosuke. Like, why would you pick up the gun? Hey, can I, like, look at the gun in the evidence? Do we have that? No. Um, oh, let's look at this, though. I wanna look at this. Examine. Oh, yeah! So there is only one... There is only one, uh, spot here. Is there anything sketchy about this? Can we find the coin? Oh, and he did have his last meal. Okay, well that's not true because the waiter was also there yes okay okay not at the table but the waiter did see it apparently
Ooh, new evidence. New evidence? A diary? A medical report card. I have no idea what this um, contradiction could be. In the other Phoenix Red games, I used to just guess using like every piece of evidence until I game over and then reloaded my save if I got stuck. <laughs> I don't want to do that here because it's the first case. Um, <laughs> oh, I think I'm gonna need Kazuma's help on this. Hey, remember, you can request for it to be entered into the court record evidence. Wait. Into the court record as evidence if you think it could be useful. Well, you'll, yeah. I'll take everything. Absolutely. Yes! If there's no penalty for doing it, why wouldn't I do it? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know what grounds. <laughs> oh, intense. Thank you. Okay, now how is this going to be useful, though? All by himself. Okay, wait, let me uh, let me see this medical report card. Um, okay, I thought I'd be able to look at it in detail. Apparently not. That sucks. Mm, examine. Okay, victim John H. Wilson, male British, time of death, November 19th, shortly after 2 p.m. Cause of death, single bullet fired at close range, fatal hemorrhage from pectoral ballistic trauma. No exit wound, bullet did not pass through the body. Um, let's look at this. Waiter's business card? Kitchen entrance. Okay, this is like, this is nothing to me. I wish I could examine this. Why can't I examine this more? Wait, I don't want to present anything. Not yet, not yet. Not yet. <laughs> that still doesn't prove that there was only one person there. Like, she could have just, like, met up with him or something. Oh, 
Um, or, or it could have been hers. <laughs> what do you say? It's not impossible that they're not all lying? Maybe she, like, maybe she shot him from an angle where nobody would have seen her. Okay, therefore, no one other than the black uniformed cadet could have dispatched the Englishman over and out. Press. Yes! was a woman sitting across the table from the professor. Um, okay. I'm gonna look at that card again. Just to get a visual here. So if this is where he died, then she would have been right here? Um... Oh, but that's super... that's super visible. That's super visible from all these other tables, so how did they not see her? Oh. Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Because then he would have only been shot from this area. What the fuck? This is so weird. There's just like a ghost. Evidence. I need more evidence to present. Thank you, okay. I was wondering why I couldn't examine it more. Crosshairs start to pulsate, press space to investigate further. Okay, let's let's take a look at this. Okay, not now, I guess. Not now, I guess. Opens? Ah, 
Oh, this is some kind of medical history. There's an entry for the day the professor was killed. Okay, so that means he did go. Extraction of molar with topical anesthesia. Wait, 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 okay, wait. And he was eating a steak? Excuse me? That's sketchy. Hey, do people like normally eat steaks after they've gotten a tooth taken out? What? Okay. So he was still under anesthesia. <laughs> At this time, that's strange. Okay. Um, now I just gotta figure out which statement it is. Okay, this one. It's this one. Yes! Got it. Man, he's too- he's like way too smart for a 23-year-old. He's too well-spoken. I have the floor, dude. I'm still doing the cross-examination. It's my floor. Has everything to do with the case. Ooh. But I mean, he was still at a restaurant, so that's also still kind of sketchy. Hmm. 
Okay, good. Okay, good. Because I thought that was weird. <laughs> no, nobody eats like right after a dentist appointment. Also, it was the lady steak. <laughs> Expertly done, partner. restaurant case have turned like a DJ part where the judge is gonna like ask us questions about the case? Uh, yes. Yes, it is. The lady. <laughs> the person eating the steak at the victim's table must have been an as yet unknown third party, the lady. serious. We have strong evidence to support our asser assertion. It's clear that these witness testimonies are unreliable. Uh, okay. Well, yeah, it's a murder. It's a murder trial. Turntables. Oh shit, that's <laughs> serious. So they're lying deliberately? Oh, 
who told them that? This is a conspiracy. To say you never saw the gentlewoman, that's what they uh told us. Oh shit. Just drop the ball there. Okay, wait, no, but that also means the waiter was lying, too. You gotta bring, bring the waiter back. Turn what a turn of events. Yeah, so it must have been like a government official then. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good, they're all corrupt then. We need to name whoever it was that tried to keep- tried to make the witnesses keep their mouths shut. Well, let me look at the medical reports because they said that the police do it so if this is inaccurate then maybe it was the police hmm there's I don't think there's a, enough information there Sweating, he's sweating buckets. Okay, no, wait, 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 wait. Let's look through this first. Do I need to examine this? I don't think I don't think I need to examine this. Oh my god, that's so bad. If you lose your pin, they won't accept you as a UMA student at the university. You may not come in, they say. Terrible. It's terrible. Bro, you can't memorize 901? Okay, that was... 
that's not super important. Okay, and there's not nothing on here. I don't think I can look at anything on here either. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Wait, what? Wait, what? Chief Inspector Satoru Hosonaga? Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. Isn't that the name of the... Isn't that the name of the waiter? Satoru Hosonaga? Who's... Who's Hosonaga? Isn't that the waiter? Oh, he's actually a police officer. That still doesn't explain the blood um, dripping down his face. <laughs> so dumb, dude. Why would he write it on on his business card like that? In fact, for a waiter to even have a business card is kind of a uh, strange. Let me look at this. So I think what I think what he's implying is that this was planned. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. He's twenty nine, dude. It looks like he's the uh, forty. Like, how do you call him to the stand not knowing that he's he's actually a police officer? Like, what the heck? That explains why he was so panicked um, when he had to submit this. Good gracious. No wonder the game didn't want allow me to examine that earlier on. Otherwise I would have like just spoiled the whole thing.
Like, that's so wild. Yeah, I'm so... I do not know that. Don't the, aren't, don't the prosecutors work closely with the police? Corrupt. They're all corrupt. Yeah, and he started coughing. Your salary must be terrible, dude. Restaurant's probably gonna come into play again. I'm guessing. Okay, so we're not gonna talk about the consequences that this officer just like lied to the court and made other people lie to the court. Bleeding again. Okay, but at this point, um, like, he's not a reliable witness, though. Who is she? She must be important that there's like a cover up happening. This is very political. The mistrial, it's called a mistrial. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> She's the only one. Gisele? Gisele? Miss Gisele Brett. That's wild, dude. Bring her in. Bring her here. Yup, yup, yup. That's the correct response. This guy's like, this guy's gonna die soon. We gotta hurry up with this trial. The fuck? Why is he like squaring up? He does look pretty pale now that I think about it. Continued. What the heck? Um, yes, I would like to save. I think this is a good place to stop uh, for the night. I'm gonna save. Um, sure one. I'm gonna save and head off for the night. And, uh, I don't know when I'm gonna play this again. I do want to be streaming more, so hopefully sometime this week or this weekend, whatever. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'll figure out a schedule. Maybe, maybe if I can get back into, uh, back into streaming. <laughs> so, yeah, thanks for watching and have a good night. Bye.